getting ready to go for a jog with Jenna Tobias. You know, I like these frames, the glasses, but I had, um, I had, when I was discovered I needed bifocals, right, just cinched that I was old. Anyway, and I managed to hold off on that until I was like 48. Anyway, I went ahead and, um, had new lenses put in these frames, because these are the D&Gs. And, um, <clears throat> I failed to get the anti-glare. So if there's sun coming at me this way, you know, you get, you get this. Anyway, so, um, what else? Um, just, it's been a rough last couple days. You know, had somebody I let go, thought I let go, thought they let go, you know, just kind of fade away. And then they made a, a comment that just kind of brought everything um, to the surface again. And I didn't, I didn't, that just bummed me out. So I just need to let it go. And I'm not going to discuss it further except to say that you failed and I didn't. Okay, because I always say what I'm going to do. And if I say what I'm going to do, I always do what I, what I say I'm going to do. And, um, you know, and, and, um, and I expect the same from other people, which is probably expecting too much. But, you know, my dad was somebody who, growing up when I was a kid, he would promise things and say things and just, you know, it, none of it would happen. So, in turn, it, it led to a lot of disappointment. And, um, and I just, now in my adult life, I'm just choosing not to have people who are like that be a part of my life. So anyway, the other part of it is there's someone else who um, just kind of, um, I kind of feel like who I thought I was in the friendship isn't who I thought I was. And that's kind of a hard pill to swallow because then it leaves me wondering where I stand. And um, because I'm just tired of going over it and over it. And, Maybe that'll end. Anyway, I'm going to go running outside, and, you know, Jenna's normally a little bit late. Pick it up. Come on, snap. Bring it. Come on. Get here, Jenna. Go on.